What is up beautiful people? It's your girl Cam and I am back with another video. Today I'm coming at you with my war binder. I'm going to be setting up my scripture writing pages for the week of November 8th. So if this is your first time visiting my channel, welcome, welcome. My name is Cam. This is Peace of the Plans and I do hope you find something here that inspires you. If you do, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified every time I create new content for you right here on this channel. If you're already a part of the fam, thank you so, so much for coming back. So guess what? I have put my war binder on the expander disc, y'all. Woo woo! She is ready to go. I finally found the gold expander discs at Michael's the other day and I was so excited. I just came straight home and just set everything up. So she is ready to rock for the rest of this year. She was getting so chunky, y'all. There's so much going on in here. I didn't know if I was going to like the expander discs or not, but after I got everything put on the disc and everything was together I really truly love it I love it love it love it so today I'm going to be using the um, squad life sticker book I'm going to go into some of these fall stickers right here these are so pretty to me so I'm going to use some of these and these and these and get this all hooked up so if you want to see how my plans come together in my scripture writing section of my war binder, just stay right there. So we are ready to rock and let me show you how things turned out um, this week. I did use um, Plant Mama and some planner dolls from Gold Mine and Coco and Isis Ella Jewels in my planner this week in my scripture writing portion and I think it turned out so gorgeous. Like this was so much fun to use. I would love to do something similar to this maybe um, in the spring. This is just so, so great. So let's go ahead and get into this week. I am going to go in and start putting down some of these stickers. And I think I want to start with this cute little box right here so 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 adorable and I think I want to add a quote to it so, so next I want to put a quote on top of there and I've got this sheet that came from the Dollar Tree and somebody asked me where do I live because they want to know where <laughs> which Dollar Trees have these types of stickers. So I live in North Carolina. I live in Charlotte. And um, yeah, what I have discovered is that you have to find the Dollar Tree in your area that has the good stuff. Like the one right around the corner from me where I live, they don't have anything. I mean, they've got stuff. But they don't have this kind of stuff. They don't have good planner stuff. But there's one about 15 minutes away from me that has all the planner goodies you would ever want like they have it all and that's where I got these from so okay let's see which one will fit in this little area um, I may have to cut this but let's see um, be strong be brave be fearless you are never alone that's cool let's kind of take a look at it on top of the sticker though the good thing about this being clear is we can kind of see what we're working with. Okay, so I could use this and just cut it in half and stretch it all the way across. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. So I'm going to go with this Be Strong, Be Brave, Be Fearless. You're Never Alone one. 
I'm just going to cut it here. Cut that off. And we're just going to stretch it all the way across. And another thing I get asked about quite a bit um, are these tweezers. And I got these from... Um, and I know a lot of you who've been with me for a long time, you already know where these came from. <laughs> but I get new people that come to my channel all the time, and I'm grateful for that. Um, so these tweezers came from Sally's Beauty Supply. And I have looked online for these tweezers. They were only a dollar. One dollar. And I have looked for these online everywhere I could think to look. And they're either not available or they're definitely not one dollar <laughs> like I've seen some like one tweezer that was like ten dollars I'm like what <laughs> y'all charging ten dollars for something that was originally one dollar <laughs> come on but anyway I know everybody trying to make a make a coin make their coin but um, if I find some that are reasonably priced I will link them down below um, but I've looked everywhere and all the ones I've seen have been very, very pricey. But that's where I got these from. So maybe check your um, local um, Sally's and see if they have them in your area. I got them around Christmas time. So this might be the perfect time to check and see if they have them. Now, let me see how I'm feeling about that. Pull this up before it sticks all the way down and straighten it out a little bit. Be strong, be fearless, you are never alone. How do I feel about that? <laughs> I'm not sure. I don't want it to pull my paper up though. I'm kind of thinking I might like it if it was down lower this is going into my Tuesday but I think it'll be okay and I think I like it better that way yeah I think I do I think I like it better like that top and bottom and then we'll work we'll work with the rest of it okay so that's good quote is in there now I normally like to set up um, something over here in this section as well and I usually put like a, a main quote from the sermon so sermon notes go on the left side scripture writing goes on the right and I normally put a powerful statement from the sermon in this box something that really hits me in the gut it goes in this box and let's see I think I will put I think I'm gonna grab this girl that is on her bike right here and put her in the corner on the left hand side I think I want to put her here I don't want to make it look like she's popping a wheelie though And then I think I'm going to, even though I've used this girl already, I think I'm going to use her again right here or here. Okay, I think I'm going to put her here.
That looks really cute. So I think I might choose the girl that has her coffee. Um, this girl right here with her coffee. Oh, that's the same girl at the top too. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're doing some repeats, but it's okay. It's okay. Do the girl with her coffee, and we'll put her right there. I'm going to have to cut off quite a bit. But then we'll just put it back right there. All right, and then we'll use the girl who is kneeling right here. I don't know if you can see her. But anyway, we're going to put her here in this section. Great, I love that. And now I am going to add a little bit of washi strip stickers, I think, if we've got some in here. If not, I'm, I may add some leaves. I don't think we have washi strip stickers in this particular book, so let's see. I think I'm going to add some leaves and some headers and then I will come back and show you how everything came together. Okay, so I'll be right back. Alright y'all, I think this is so, so, so cute. I am loving, loving, loving how this looks. Just taking one last look at it before I wrap this up. I think I want to add one more thing. I've got a lot of mushrooms I can add on here. I think I do. If I have enough, I might put some across the bottom. I don't think I have as many as I thought. Ah, rats. Um, I kind of want to put something across the bottom though. Let's see how this looks. I just want something down here. This feels like I just feel like it needs a little something to kind of ground it. Uh, I might not like this though. Let's see. I think it works. I think it works. Yeah, I think that works. Okay. So now I am satisfied with this spread. I think it looks really, really good. Um, I think it's very simple, leaves me lots of space to write. And that really is the functional purpose for this section, um, to put my sermon notes over here and my scripture writing for the week over here on the right. And again, I am using, for scripture writing this month, I'm using the thanks and giving 
I found this on Google. Um, a couple of you asked me to link it, so I will probably try to link it down in the description box so you can grab it for yourself. And I'll probably try to link this one too. This is for December gifts and blessings. So let's pop this back in the planner and take one last look at it. All right, y'all, that's going to do it for me for this spread. I use the Happy Planner Squad Life for this spread. I think it turned out super, super cute. Um, kind of simple and clean, and I love it. I like to mix things up. I think last week was a little bit more busy. So yeah, I'm keeping this week nice and clean, but still very, very pretty and very fun and very autumn, of course. We got to keep it fall. So thank you so much for joining me for this video. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to give me a big thumbs up. If you're not already subscribed, what are you waiting on? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button along with the notification bell so you won't miss out on any of the fun right here on this channel. If you're already a part of the fam, I appreciate you so, so much for coming back. I hope you all are having a good time spending time in God's Word. I hope that you are taking some time to um, pray more as we end this year and get ready for a new year. And I hope that you're spending some good quality time in God's presence and studying His Word. Have a great week. I hope it's full of love, joy, and most of all, peace. See you next time.